dear students now let us going to see the grammar present tense grammar book its ninth chapter ki chapter 9 in grammar book first one simple present tense okay see the given sentence there is a mango on the table see here in this sentence here the verb is see this one is okay this is refers to present tense okay there is a mango on the table the verb is refers to present tense see the second sentence i ate a mango yesterday so here the verb ate this verb this refers to the past action okay see the third sentence i shall eat another mango tomorrow so this one shall eat this verb refers to future action okay so there are three main tenses now you understood that there are three main tenses one is present tense second is past tense third one is future tense okay next under each main tense there are four forms okay under the each main tense there are three main tenses one is present tense past tense and future tense under each tense there are four forms first one is simple second one is continuous third one is perfect fourth one is perfect continuous okay. now let us going to see the first one simple present Let's consider the example first to express the permanent truth simple present tense is used to express permanent truth see example summer follows spring okay summer follows spring then honest honey is a sweet so these are the simple present tense second one it's used to to refer the sim present period okay the action is present at present see the example my father works in a college okay then again the simple present tense is used to to express habitual actions example i get up early in the morning okay then fourth one the simple present tense is used to to refer future actions example the class begins at 9 9 am okay so the simple present tense is used to to give instructions also example first you boil the milk like that exam instructions then sixth one the simple present is used to to used in commentaries okay srinath ba ranatunga okay it's used to like commentaries also exercise see that one first one children dash a lot of sweet in bracket they give to eat so the answer is eat children eat a lot of sweets second one c dash to bangalore once in a month to drive so the answer is drives okay she drives to bangalore once in a month third one my auntie does in an english medium school so my auntie teaches in english medium school fourth one water boils at 100 degree c fifth one radha and rosi wear glasses okay so like that you complete the remaining one. then see the next exercise in page number 35 cross out the wrong one of the two verbs given in each sentence okay here two verbs are given you have to cross out the wrong one in first sentence prefer is the wrong one so cross it out the correct answer is i am preferring indian things to foreign things in second sentence that understand that is a wrong one cross it out okay 
my brother is understanding english well then third sentence no is the wrong one cross it out there are knowing the conditions of the victim in fourth one do you see is the wrong wrong one okay so strike it out okay in fifth sentence you are always healthy so here a is the wrong one strike it out like that you complete the remaining thank you